Okay, I'm back. Bayonetta. Let's do a chapter. I was very close to streaming last night. Then some unexpected shit came up. But I figured I, I could at least, you know, before I do anything tonight, I could at least do like one chapter. I do want to finish this game like soon, so I'm gonna probably over the next few days um, into early next week, like try to play this nightly so I can finish it and then get Captain Toad. Uh, do I want to do anything in particular here? glasses. <laughs> the glasses aren't magic, silly. I can see the monsters without them. Monsters? Not quite. So, uh, has Bayonetta, I mean your mom, been fighting these big bad monsters for a long time? Mummy is a witch, and witches protect people and are very strong. When oh, I grow okay. up, be strong too, and I'll protect my money. Wait, you think witches do what? Oh, forget it. No point in arguing with a little kid. I'll manage on my own. I'm sure you will. Money! He is dead now. Shit. You never cease to amuse me, Cheshire. I suppose that's your next target. <laughs> this is yours, little one. You didn't cry while I was gone, did you? <laughs> nope. Good. Bayonetta, no matter how I ask, no matter how many times, you always say the oh, same thing. Come now, Kitty. You know it was A all just... A misunderstanding. You're so stubborn, you know that? My father. He was a journalist, too. In fact, he was twice the man I could ever hope to be. He was obsessed with one case his entire career. A case so bizarre it took over his life. They could have made a movie of the details. The followers of darkness, the Umbra Witches, and their light world counterparts, the Lumen Sages, controlling everything with a power known as the Eyes of the World. Then, the Light and Dark Clan suddenly disappeared from their medieval home in Europe. You may be familiar with the town. You're standing in it. <gasps> Welcome to Vigrid, 500 years later. 500 years? Clan, working at the behest of the powers that be, sought to lead their fractured world towards peace. They both possessed an eye said to have the power to create history that they used to oversee the world. However, their spirit of cooperation did not last. For a month, these things them, often don't. A pair of young star crossed lovers conceived a child that sent the clans on a path to ruin. The woman was thrown in jail, and the man exiled from his clan. However, the child remained with the Umbra, raised as a black sheep even amongst the darkness. Since the balance between light and dark had been lost, both clans spiraled into decay. The legend had it that the two eyes could be united to control reality itself. And this legend fueled ambition, and desire, leading to a myriad of battles between the clans. In fact, 
It led to their mutual destruction. My father was mocked for buying such a fairy tale. However, I believed his story. And I believe it more than ever now that I've found you. The memory of the clan lingers on, despite the passing of 500 years. What on earth was my father searching for? And why did he have to die for it? I have to discover the truth with my own eyes. That's why I haven't given up my chase for it. Or you. The head of the Ithaval group, the multinational that dominates Vigrid, recently tried to sell an enormous gemstone on the black market. If he isn't selling out in the open, it means we're going to have to acquire it by other means. And that starts by sneaking onto that jet. Wait, the, the one that went the opposite direction? something I am how did you lose it little one do you have anything you really like something really important to you uh, the doll yes this I love it oh okay She doesn't remember anything. Those legs, Jesus Christ. Never lose it. Understand, little one? You must keep it safe, close to your heart. encouraging. Okay, I'm ready to fight something now. Okay, I'm, I'm relearning my tech, my cheap technique. So that's how this is going to happen. Yes, punish! Punish! Oh, 
Oh, there's no enemies here. I thought there was an enemy. Oh, it's just a giant hand reaching through the, the aircraft. Nothing out of the ordinary here. Oh, there's a foot that time? Okay, yeah, I don't I don't like this dragon fella. The Valkyrie military transport. Unfittingly for a city of its small size, Vigrid plays host to a large military airbase. The roar of takeoff and landings that engulf the city are not that of passenger planes, but of incredibly large military transport jets known as Valkyries. I have been aboard American military transports many times in an official capacity, and I've seen many of the finest jets up close. However, none compares to even a distant view of a Valkyrie. The size difference is clearly evident like the difference in size between a crow and an eagle. To think that something that large could fly in the sky is something that I still cannot believe despite having seen it with my own eyes. Of course, there is no doubt that the cargo it carries is quite dangerous, so seeing the plane's huge mass literally drop onto the runway during landings caused me to feel a deep anxiety, as if the weight of the plane were literally landing on my shoulders. It leads one to wonder what the authorities are bringing into this little principality, with all the extreme security they have in, in place. Vigrid has long since cut most ties with the outside world and has roared, reared itself within its own unique culture. Perhaps it is this influence that led to the Valkyrie's equally unique design. At a glance, one can see the deep religious influence in its design, or perhaps that view is simply our de deference to a plane born of technology so different from our own that we simply nod our heads in astonishment at the miracle of flight. Like an eagle is to a pigeon. Oh god, I gotta fight this dude? Here? Two dudes? Jesus. It's like talk about a crash course. Just thrown right back into it. Shit. Just about to do a torture attack too. That one up. Nice there you go. Have fun with that.
Nice. It comes back pretty quick. Learning how to you know, do the combos and stuff. Even though I need more practice. It's coming back a little bit. Okay, this is the Gajalar Horn. At the center of the man-made island of Isla del Sol, there is a display of sheer military force unimaginable for the likes of Vigrid. A display whose menacing power even I cannot shake. While there is very little public face to these efforts, if my information is correct, the military spending here rivals that of even the great powers in the world. Moreover, amongst the, power, uh, amongst the towers of enterprise and government, the other buildings stand at anti-aircraft countermeasures. These buildings, a strategic defense initiative known as Gajalhorns, are equipped with a battery of anti-aircraft SAM missiles and have been placed in four corners of the island. What in the world would cause a small place like this to install these such dramatic defenses? There's also word that Americans are involved in the armament and expansion of the military complex here. It is said that the Ithaval group is undertaking some sort of next generation energy research and thus has traded rights to this technology for added force of arms. It is not wholly unbelievable story. Seeing all of the military takeoffs and landings here in Vigrid, I don't want to think their destination is actually the place I call home. Yep, the journals were written by Cheshire. No matter how much you ask, I'm not putting a chain Oh, Cheshire's on. dad, sorry. So what do you want? I don't even remember how to do some of these things. Crow can uh, dive into nearby enemies. Which twist? Spinning. Press X while holding ZR. I'm good. I don't want to get this stuff. Don't really have a lot of money for anything. Can I buy a witch heart? Could buy a witch heart. I don't know how many I have though. I'm not, I'm not gonna buy anything right now. Where am I going? Someone recommended I jump onto the other engine? What do you mean exactly? Continue that way, there's an Alfheim. Oh god. Everyone's telling me different things now. Over here, there's an Alfheim. Where is it? Fuck. Oh. 
enemies here. Oh god, camera. did something. Oh, there it is. Okay, there's the alpha. Get ready for me not to be able to complete this. It's going to be awesome. I'm on a limited, like, schedule, or I'm on a limited time frame at the moment, so I don't think I'll be able to. You must be out of body to defeat the enemies. Oh, boy. Wait, what the hell is this? I don't I don't understand. I don't understand what's happening here. Poppycox. Oh, oh, which time only or ranged, apparently. Oh, and, and if they attack that, then I take damage. I see. It makes sense now. I'll try one more time. I'm, I'm not going to attempt this forever. Fuck you. This one's fairly easy, really? No, really, last last one. I mean, I guess I could just do that, right? That's kind of cheap. Range does indeed work. I'm not doing this. 
This will. I'll, I'll spend the next half hour trying to do this. Um, also, someone said there was a treasure chest. Oh, there it is. I think. There we go. That's what I wanted. Fuck. This way, and then out this way, and I think this is where I have to be. Um, oh. There's some like meat flapping skin faces happening here. <laughs> Pure platinum for holding the shoot button. Troubling you. Only your constant fretting over my state of affairs. I've no time to play games with you. No need to take out your stress on me, Bayonetta. It's clear you're worried for the girl. <laughs> oh, my God. Next level pole dancing. Delusional. If I leave her, he'll never shut up about it. And his whining is twice as irritating as anything the child could muster. <laughs> You've quite the tongue when it comes to curling round the truth. And what about you? What are you hiding? What was that? Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think these might mean something to you. I've no need for worthless junk. Look at this fucking thing. I am well aware of my task, but you have forgotten that I do not need your help. <laughs> <laughs> it seems your little friend is gone forever. with hatred. Accept your violent fate. Accept it and earn the left eye. Prove you Lisa deserve. Left Eye Lopez? I have no idea what's happening right now. My dear sweet Frodo. 
Shit. Oh my god. Motorcycle? That's cheating. That is cheating. Shit, I'm gonna die. Uh, I don't like this. Um, items. Can I make one of these? Fucking missile. The plane is in the water. Jesus. Pressing the button so hard. Here we go. This could be it. <laughs> Fucking gotcha. Took a lot of fucking damage, though. Whoops. Not yet. She isn't ready. What am I supposed to do here?
Can I just play the entire game like this? Just, that's it. I'll, I'll just play the game like that. Hey, check this out. What are you buying? <laughs> Heard that in a game once. What are you buying? <laughs> Okay, um, do I want to use health? I definitely don't want to die, so I'm just going to use... I thought I had one. Okay, I guess I don't. Oh, here we go. I have to use it here. Alright, here we go. It's a book there. Someone remind me to read that next time I play this. I, I don't have the time right now. Little one, where are you? Little one, can you hear me? Mommy, 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 Teresa, mommy, I'm so scared. No crying. Know the rules. No cockroaches or crying babies. Time to go, little one. Hold on tight, okay? Okay. I don't. Okay. Escort mission. Oh she, oh, she was getting attacked. That's cool. I thought there was only one enemy there. And then I was fighting the only enemy there. Wasn't paying attention. Awesome. It was the fucking electrified water that killed her. It's another one. Okay.
Okay, I did it. Oh, there's more. Oh, boy. Chainsaw time. Jesus. Can't get out of this. here. Why is everything going slow motion when I'm in this mode? It's kind of throwing me off a bit. Finally. All right, good. Stone metal. Stone. Yep, stone. Oh, what a day. God damn it. Alright, I'm gonna check out the art and then I gotta get going, so... Let me... Do that now. Oh, wait. I've gotta do angel attack first. I've got as much as I need now. Okay, 66 is really good. I think 70 is the most expensive thing that you could buy. It's the Red Hot Shop, but still, I get the Blue Witch Heart. I chiseled it, Luigi. So this is chapter 13, and there's 16 chapters, so I'm, I'm pretty damn close. Maybe like one or two more streams of this. 
and it'll be finished. So we'll, we'll get there. I know I've been dragging it out a bit. I apologize to the Bayonetta fans for that. But Far Cry and Smash and 10,000 other things. But uh, it'll it'll be done soon. Now tonight, I am going to check out the art. Uh, Lemango wants me to tell everyone, please remove the tag me tag. If you don't know what that is, well, just remove it. <laughs> it's on the Buru. You can get rid of it just by tagging your stuff appropriately, and then that'll be gone. So let's check out the art. Uh, I don't know how far back to go, actually. John Shroom, Bonzi and Alpaca. Okay, I think we're on the right track. From Assassin Kiyashi. Yep, that is me as Bayonetta. This is from the other night, actually. <laughs> um, did you have to make an excessive bulge? <laughs> it's amazing. It really is amazing. Uh, from C. This is Ch -ch 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 Jesus from Tomodachi. I forgive you, man. I want to buy some weed. From Queen Jades, there's the John Trio. From... Chewy 98 <coughs> from Pixelite from same person it's, uh, sideways from Vulcan 8 bit how a Bonzi and Alpaca mate from Potato Boy it's a Doom Vine Shroom uh, from Captain Palace Vlinny is coming to town. From SRI. Oh shit, these wraps are tight. One second. Okay, from Vulcan 8-Bit. That's, that's how you get grapes. You fry them up. You fry up the material and then the grapes follow. Let's see who else do we have here. From Counterfeit Guys. Is that how you say your name? Counterfeit Guys. There's Ralph in his Christmas sweater. From the Bassman 92. This isn't from my stream. I don't really get the reference. From Greenworth. Um, it's sideways. And uh, I'm not going to attempt to read that. But, you know, you could just flip it if you want to on your own. From Vulcan 8-Bit, <laughs> here's Bing. Uh, from Greenworth again, here's Two-Face. Again, I'm not reading this because I actually got to go like 10 minutes ago. I have to go. From Queen Jades. From Snivy Girl. Alpaca and Bonzi. From Potato Hide. I don't think, I don't know what this is. Copyright. What did you just upload to the... I don't know. It doesn't look like something that... It looks like it's copyrighted. From Super Lexi. So don't do that if, if it is. You know, that's that's stupid. Um, That's not from my stream. God, streaming at the same time as someone else has its downfalls. From Tev216. Johns, we now have corns. Time to stick it in the cornhole. Oh, God damn it. Uh, moving on from Dude Guy three seventy one, from Mamizo Sama, from Navigator Prime, from uh, Tita Titanium. Here's a little comic on. I guess you could call it a comic based on the Johns from Gamasaur. Vine Toad, 
uh from this isn't from my stream from Depeche <laughs> Depeche Chode <laughs> Jen Jen and Jen uh from Cold Steak from I think that might be close to all there is actually and from Kirby Derp hang on it's it's still it's loading yeah from Kirby Derp there you go that's pretty awesome and I think that's it for my stream so I, if I missed your art I'm sorry I really I gotta get going but thank you everyone for watching and I'll see you I'll see you soon. And from Lump F. Here's one more. Okay. I don't like the way XSplit handles moving pictures. It's it's weird and it's it's making me crazy. Anyway, fine. Good enough. I'll see you guys later. Thank you for watching. I will probably be back maybe tomorrow. I'll stream some stuff. And Sunday, of course, as well. So thank you all. See you soon. Bye.